Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I still hold a strong conviction and a strong belief in the upside of Cardano. And we're going to talk about why that is in this video. But the title of this video, you saw it. That's why you're here, right? Cardano to $10 is inevitable. Now, of course, nothing is guaranteed in crypto, but I feel really, really strong about this. Now, will it happen in the next cycle or the next cycle after that? I'm not exactly 100% sure. Now, we do know we're about a 10x roughly away from all-time highs today, right? But if Cardano had a market cap of $350 billion, which I do think we could get there in the next bull run, one ADA would be worth $10. That means an upside of 26x from today's price at 36 cents. Now, in this video, I want to break down what's going on behind the scenes because, yes, the price is trending downwards here. And the overall crypto market is heading in that direction right now as well. Volume is up, but a lot of that is sell pressure. We did dip all the way down to the 35 cent range, guys. You can see that here in the last day. We've actually hit that a couple different times uh, down here on the 8th yesterday as well. We go out to the one year, you could see. It's been an interesting year here in 2023. We actually popped all the way up to about 46 cents back in mid-April. But since that time frame, we have been trending down. And we might even go down and retest the 30 cent level. If we do, that's where I'll be looking to load back up my ADA bags. Now, what's been happening around Cardano is the whale activity has been ramping up. And this suggests confidence amid the price drop. This is what matters behind the scenes. Of course, we just had Hydra go live as well. A lot of great things happening in the Cardano ecosystem, a huge partnership uh, that I think is massive that's not being talked about enough with Singularity Net. Uh, we already know what some of the uh, larger partnerships in the works are already doing for the future of Cardano. And of course, we had the huge upgrade last year and how that's already evolving. Cardano's down about 13% from its 2023 peak, but transaction volumes, sky high, up 42% from a month ago. Cardano whales have increased trading activity in this past week. And Cardano lost the $0.40 cent support level on May 1st as news of regulators rescuing the First Republic Bank collapse sent several Layer 1 coins, Bitcoin including, spiraling. Now, compared to April... There has been a considerable upturn in the volume, however, of transactions completed on the Cardano network. On-chain data from Cardano shows how the transaction volume has consistently stayed above 2 billion since April 10th. This is a huge increase for us. April 10th, uh, between April 10th and the close of May 3rd, there's been a rise, a 42% rise in the volume of dollars spent on the Cardano network. You can see it right there in that chart. When transaction volume rises consistently, it suggests a steady increase in demand for the core services and products hosted on the blockchain. For Cardano, it gets even more bullish considering the ADA transaction volumes only exceeded $2 billion on two occasions in the entire Q1 2023. Now, if this uptrend in traction remains steady, ADA investors can expect a price rebound, which I do think we're going to get at some point here in 2023 with all of the top altcoins, with all of the top layer ones. Hold on one sec. Take a sip. Ah, oh, that's good. Now, how about the Cardano whales? They're still betting big despite recent retracement. They are buying the dip, if you will. Despite recording a recent 4% price correction, Cardano whales appear unfazed. They are in accumulation mode. The chart below shows how large daily transactions have increased from $8.07 billion to $10.81 billion between April 28th and May 3rd. Large transaction is a financial metric that sums the total of transactions that exceed $100,000 on a given trading day. When its signal increases, uh, when it increases, excuse me, its signal, it signals that whale investors are increasing their bets on the underlying asset. And they have been doing that. The steady rise in Cardano transaction volume and the increase in whale activity are critical bullish signs for the longevity of Cardano. If these metrics continue to rise, ADA holders can participate, uh, excuse me, anticipate more price upswing in the coming days and weeks. So I do think we're going to break out of this for Cardano. I think eventually we're going to get back up there uh, to a new peak. If bullish outlook, if this bullish outlook plays out, 
The TA shows us that ADA could reach a new 2023 peak of 51 cents. At that zone, profit taking by a cluster of 466,000 investors that had bought 2.47 billion coins at an average price of 51 could slow down the rally, but we shall see. Again, longevity of Cardano, not in question for me. Now, if Cardano price loses the support, loses that support of right around 37 cents, which it has briefly here, right? Which it has, we could be seeing 31 cents. That is what I'm waiting for. Now, that's not financial advice. That is where I will be personally accumulating more Cardano. I already have a healthy amount, but I'll continue to add to one of my favorite crypto assets because of the underlying factors that I see happening on chain, not looking at price, looking at on chain, looking at partnerships that have been inked, looking at the vision, the leadership, and the fact that Cardano, still a top 10 crypto, it's been that way virtually since its launch six years ago. My name's Zach. Let me know what you guys think down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Hit that like button for us. Push us up in the old YouTube algorithm. We'll see you in the next video. Peace out.